family, friends, subscribers, internet strangers. What's up? Here to pick it back at you. So this video is a follow-up video. Uh, I'll see if I can remember to link the first one up here. We're gonna go revisit. Goodwill. Um, if you hadn't checked out the other video, make sure you do that because it is, you need to have a, a point of reference for what we're about to experience. The Goodwill here in Huntsville, I mean, understand this, Huntsville is a city with 400,000 people as one Goodwill. Let that process in your brain that a, a, a city this large has one Goodwill. Um, the old owners used to truck everything out here to Birmingham where they where they had paid employees to sort it and who knows where it went from there because uh, the goodwill in Birmingham was not great either. Had a feeling it all went online or it was sold by the pallet, whoever, however they decided they wanted to deal with it. But the new owners who have bought a lot of the stores here in North Alabama are taking them, taking them back to what a goodwill is what you normally have, you know, a goodwill that serves the community, that has lots of stuff that people can buy, that you can use in the community. So, we are headed to see what changes have been made, and I'm going to take you along with it. Is this still the world's worst goodwill? Is it still just a goodwill that is full of target returns, faded glory, some old books, and a bunch of empty shelves, and glassware that you've never, ever heard of, just plain generic. I think it's going to be a lot better, but hey, let's go. Oh, and a new time, new, new first time, someone asked in a, in a video last night, we're on Shane's show, could you do a YouTube show with just a phone? This is my new phone, so we're going to see how this, this records video. All right, so it still looks a lot the same. I've been here a few minutes because you don't can't do video and talk on this this phone at the same time. A lot of games. We'll stop here and look. Has anybody started shopping for Christmas stuff yet? Okay, how about Halloween? Oh, everybody needs a Santa cookie jar for three dollars. Okay, maybe not. They still get a lot of those are fifteen dollars a jug, which is half price of what you can buy. But still, you come to Goodwill expecting a deal, not a. You can get fifty percent off at Walmart. Some office stuff. They still have a lot of a lot of junky looking clothes. I don't do clothes. Here's where some of the difference is. There used to be a metal gate right here and they processed everything behind here and it was covered up and you couldn't see it. But now they sell stuff over here. And they had these bins. They're a hundred dollars as is and they're just full of electronics. So you see there's that's some kind of receiver right there. There's a lamp. There's a DVD player. It's got a little twist to it. Probably no good. Um, there's just... It's $100 as is. There's remotes in there. Phones. Speakers. More remotes. Modems. Crock pods. Lamps. There's an Xbox. There's a PC in there. That looks like a speaker for a thing. There's something there in the blue box. So they have this one. And then you turn around over there. I don't know if you can see them back there in the background. Focus. There's a, There's two more back there. I kind of like this uh, zoom on this camera. See, watch. 
This is the new Samsung uh, S10 Plus. You might need a Christmas tree. They seem to be in. I have a morph board. I don't have any idea what that is. Um, I've got four books to send in. At least this will pay for my Scout of Fire. A Scout IQ subscription. Oops. You break it, you bought it. But it's. Other than having a few more items, I haven't noticed a difference in quality, quantity. What in the heck are these things? Anybody know? Hmm. If you need some bed sheets, there's some target target returns. And more of this miscellaneous grass where it just dominates everything. I'll give you a burger in a minute. Alright, so what do I think? Maybe there's some improvement. Maybe it's not the absolute worst. But it's not somewhere that I'm coming back anytime soon. Um, they have a lot of stuff that's out. A little more than last time, but I don't know. There's just... <laughs> Harlan did pick up some nice things the other day, and uh he works down by here but man not the bearded picker just the books all right tell me what you guys think in the comments below like comment subscribe uh the little thing comes up appreciate you roll tide